Today I am gonna work on this hazy winter night shot and try giving it more clarity, color and sharpness with the Lightroom free app. First going here to the crop menu and tapping on straighten. Most of the times the auto straighten works pretty well. You can always rotate manually if needed. Next step is to flatten the image and try to recover as many details as possible in the light menu. First I'm gonna reduce the highlights. Not too much as this is a dark setting. Next increasing the shadows for more details in the darker parts. Adding just a bit of brightness to the brightest parts by increasing the whites. On the other side I am gonna reduce the blacks quite a bit to make the darkest parts almost black for more contrast. Also increasing the overall exposure a little. Now to remove haze there is already a slider with the same name in the effects menu. Here moving the dehaze slider to the right to remove haze, won't go to the maximum as it looks too unnatural. I will leave a bit of haze at least at the far end in the background. And I am going to leave the other sliders, not going to make any changes there. Next for some sharpness. Here with the two finger swipe and the masking slider I am going to try to choose where the sharpening effect will be applied that is on the white areas. The starting point of the slider affects the whole image. The more you move to the right, the selection mask decreases. So moving till I find the right parts where the sharpening effect should be applied. Next adding sharpening with the sharpening slider. After removing the haze, adding a bit of vibrance in the color menu. Then to the mix for the HSL sliders. Here moving the blue hues more towards aqua. Making the blues a bit more bright by adding luminance. Also decreasing the saturation a little. Now moving the yellow hues towards oranges, adding some saturation. Also increasing the saturation and brightness of the oranges to make them pop a bit. Now going to the curves for tuning the contrast. Adding more darkness to the shadows. And some brightness to the mid-tones and the highlights. Here's the final output. Thanks for watching.